Oh, so uh, welcome back to Structural Analysis Made Fun and Easy. So this is just finding the... So we're now going to um, finish finding out what the bearing pressures are under the base. So P min on P max is given by RV over B. But there's another video. There's two more videos maybe. There's one going to be on the wall sliding friction for the base. And because RV is also equal to RR, in my opinion, it's not labelled properly, RV should equal RR and so because here P equals RV over B RV the value of RV RV is an RV is the sum of the load of the vertical loads but it's not necessarily concentric so it's not quite right this isn't quite right in my opinion so that's why I need another video just to tidy it up and explain why I think it's not quite right so RV but for for the for how he's done it, P min and P max equals R V equals R R over B divided by one plus or minus six E over B because area for this is going to be per meter run of retaining wall. So instead of having area equals B times uh, L, we can just have B. <coughs> and remember that M M equals six uh, M equals E times R V. So that's why, um, so you get 280.3 divided by 3, so that's RV over B. So P, P max, P min is 280.3 over 3 times 1 plus or minus 6 times 0 0.36 over 3. Remember that 368 was the uh, eccentricity. That's not the lever arm. The eccentricity is the lever. The eccentricity is a, is a separate lever arm from the center line, not from the corner of the base. Since 368 is less than 500 that means the again uh, the base is stable because it's within the middle third on the left hand side and so anywhere on the right hand side is okay. So therefore the P, the P max is, 100, is 162 and the P min is equal to 26 so therefore um, the base is okay. Well, you, so the, as long as you've got say bearing capacity of 200 kilonewtons per meter and um, that might be in sand oh yeah I guess it would be sand and gravel not necessarily clay because um, the pressures the as we were looking for the lateral pressures seem to more towards it being in gravel and sand rather than clay so um, so uh, the maximum pressure is 162 so as long as you had bearing capacity of 200 that would be say okay and the minimum is 26 kilonewton per meter square per per run so that means there's no up, uplift and that means that the, ba the base is stable and so the moment is not enough to tip it over basically um so please come back to watch the other next videos where i'm just going to clarify that thing about what rv is because in my opinion uh, his RV it's not quite right it should be different and um, uh, um, uh, yeah th please like and subscribe to the channel uh, thanks for watching see you in the next vid yo see you in the next video